Hi, I'm Christina. I'm Grace. Jamie. Jamie. <laughs> and here's our our music video on Bryozel. We were searched at Bryoz and lab. Showed Dr. Dowd we were cool. And when we found out they're aquatic animals, we knew they were on hard substrate, and we knew that includes sand grains, rock shells, wood, kelp, and algae. But most living in shallow waters and immobile and societal, some still creep about. But I want to be hermaphroditic like them. Never really know what that means. It means they have male and female sex organs, and they'll never be alone. And you don't want to know the soft violence like this. Pilo Kamada, Jim Lomada, that's it. And they want to be up on that rock Ian, up on that rock Ian. All they eat are microorganisms, microorganisms. Bryoza, all they eat are microorganisms. Protrosomes or deutrosomes, that's what's up. They get along with common ancestors of Ricotta and Dermata because the relatives have some cordata. But these can't be the same species, no. Because one is plastic and one is phylogenetic. In the larger stage, they are so used and metamorphized soon. Then they open up. Now you don't want to be eaten by sea urchin like Bryoza, or have a defense where the spikes come off like Bryoza, and have three tissue layers and an exoskeleton. Have two digestive openings and use them to eat by fish. Have a water vascular system and slide past fish. And getting stuck up on that rock thing and respiring by diffusion and clinging. All they eat are microorganisms. Microorganisms. Bryoza. All they eat are microorganisms. Research to Bryozoa and lab. Now, now Chase thinks we're cool. And when we found out zoids are independent colonies, it was a breakthrough. They're responsible for feeding and excretion of waste too. They're real big ballers and they do a million functions like defense and fertilization. Now you want to know they have systems even if they're solitary. That means they provide the exoskeleton and internal organs you see. And we go back on time and you'll see Brezo are 490 million years old. And lack of Brezo on the Cambrian period indicates this. The stem group might have had a soft physique. We want to know the position of ectoports on that clay thinking. Position of the ectoprots on that clay thinking. We don't know. You're spot on. The clay ectoports we don't know is spot on the clay. Now we're just undergrads, and this is what we got. Are treating you along with article writers because they had Lophotrizo as a common ancestor and we did not. We can't fix the graph, no, because we cannot look up. Some information whose data proves Lophotrizo are our ancestors of Prizo and now what? Bras are closely related to the Econodermata on our data tree. Bras are not either of oysters, and they know to survive they compete with sponges. 
and there's a lot of the internet kids. They want to be the last one on that rock clinging. Stuck up on that rock clinging. All they eat are microorganisms. Our microorganisms. Right, All they eat are microorganisms. Our microorganisms. Our microorganisms.